she support you for having your own life? What are you saying, Esme? Life? You mean she doesn't care? <laughs> no. I Welcome, Welcome to, to our YouTube, YouTube channel. channel. My name is Esme. It's me, Roger. And, and welcome, welcome to Roger, Roger and Esme Vlogs. So today's subject, Filipina green flags. Before we start, again, salamat sa inyong pagkigugma o pagsuporta sa among channel. Thank you so much for your love and support, guys. And if you're new to this channel, don't forget to click like, share, and subscribe. And hit the notification bell for new uploads or new videos. So long time no see. Hi. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a while. So we're here right now to talk and discuss about the positive side of Filipina. Yes, because you always hear about the negative side. How about the positive side? You always hear like Filipinas are scammers, gold diggers, blah, blah, blah. So yeah. here we are giving you good vibes, people. <laughs> yeah, and Esme will give you like more details about those uh, green flags of Filipinas. Yeah, so yes, and you can really relate to this, especially if you are in a good relationship. Absolutely, guys. So, without further ado... First one, they vocalize what they feel towards you. So it's not just love, guys, but also the way they handle arguments. Mm -hmm, so they okay. vocalize and express what they feel inside in order not to prolong the problem. And it's better to resolve it right away. It's good because you can build a relationship which is healthy. Yes, and it's not toxic. It's better that way too because when it comes to having a good relationship, you need to express what you feel and what your thoughts are so that the partner that your partner would understand you right and you will know that uh, this filipina has this kind of green flags because at first she's very open on her feelings or emotions towards you yeah and she's really transparent about everything like her opinion her thoughts she would express it right away and that's a good thing about her. She's honest. Right. Next is, their words match their action. So when it comes to being same, it's hard sometimes. Because there are people that would just say something, but they don't really act. Mm. There are also people that they don't really say something, but they act more. Yeah, they're good at um, action. But having those two traits is way better because if you want if you promise something with your partner you need to do it and that's showing your commitment in the relationship yeah but i can say if you have that kind of uh, trait that you have that both it's hard to find that kind of filipina because mostly filipinas are good at keeping their feelings or emotions yeah, some Filipinas would just talk about it, but they don't really act. There are also silent Filipinas that they're more on action, but they're lacking of words. Maybe because they cannot communicate well. They, they cannot express well. Yeah, there are a lot of reasons. But if you will find a Filipina, like they would act at the same time, they would also talk and promise that they would do it you are a lucky person <laughs> <laughs> so now you have to remember that guys <laughs> yes. good at both <laughs> next is she support you for having your own life what are you saying Esme? <laughs> life you mean she doesn't care <laughs> <laughs> no i'm not actually saying that meaning to say when it comes to having a long relationship there would always be changes like if you've been together for 10 years eight years or more than that there would always be changes along the way yeah of course and also you have to remember that each individual has its own goal in life 
Yes, we have different goals. Like same as me, my dream is to be a famous tattoo artist. Roger wants to be knowing a lot of computer stuff. That's my goal. That I want to be like this. I want to be like that. And then all you need to do is to communicate with your partner that okay, let her understand. Yes, and support each other. Cause if you would have the support of your partner, you would really feel that oh, you didn't love. Like she understands me. Right. Other thing that you need to know if you are dating or talking to a Filipina online for a few months. You have to really know this green flag because it's a sign which this Filipina has a good traits. Yes. Okay, that she will support me all the way. She's a keeper. Yeah, a keeper. Yes. So don't misunderstand that maybe she doesn't care about me, but this kind of a trait or green flag is good to have a strong relationship. Yes, because if you support each other, it shows that you really need you really care for each other right yeah because you know what she likes what you like right and aside from that since in a relationship you have common goals as well then it's really better and you have to support that each other all you need to do is to communicate yes next is she respects your boundaries so all of us has boundaries but it's kind of rare for a Filipina to set a boundary. <laughs> I would say it's difficult to find a Filipina that would respect your boundaries. For you to know that Filipinas are really good at investigating. <laughs> yeah, they're good at spying. <laughs> spying. Well, you have to be upfront that, okay, uh, we have to set boundaries in our relationship. It doesn't mean that I don't love you or care for you, but uh, there are times that you need to, or instances, that you, we have to put boundaries in our relationship. Especially for the phone, guys. So, different nationalities, you put boundaries, you don't want anyone to touch your phone even if it's your wife or whatnot. Because that's your private stuff. Yeah, and it's a great example because here in the Philippines, a uh, Filipino couple, they're very transparent to one another. like. There's no hidden agenda. Everything, password, all that stuff, they know. Yes, because that's just what we are. That's our culture. Yeah. And that's how we show that we trust each other. There's no hidden problems towards each other. And uh, why Filipino couples did that? Because they have to be like away from arguments and all the shitty stuff. Yes, because it's better that way in order for you not to explain yourself because your wife already seen it, right? right. <laughs> <laughs> Next is, she is genuinely kind to everyone. So mm. not just you, but people that are special. Okay, like, like give me to say, okay, it's me. I want to share my, you know. <laughs> <laughs> no, not people like that. that are special, meaning to say your family, your best friend. So she is kind to everyone like especially the people that you feel special yeah close to close to like your family so she is extra kind towards them because you love them so she would also show that she loves them too yeah you will know that this filipina is having this kind of trait or green flag if she will also put it in action Yes. Because uh, like we mentioned earlier, not just by words, but if she will do that, like loving your family or friends at the same time, well, that's a good sign. That's a good sign that she really is serious in your relationship. Because when it comes to Filipinas showing their kindness towards family, towards friends that are close to you, meaning to say she cherish you she cherish your relationship next is she is curious about you maybe you're thinking interrogation no it's not <laughs> <laughs> well i think um if they will be having a relationship especially long distance if a filipina having a lot of questions about yourself about your backgrounds and all that stuff meaning to say she's willing to know you to know everything about you 
because it's not just about the physical appearance, the basic traits, the basic personality that you're showing. It's actually knowing you as a whole, knowing the important things, knowing your allergies, everything. <laughs> Like the things that you don't like, the things that you like, what are the colors that you want. Yeah, so, and also she's very excited knowing you in person. And if she's really like talkative in person, then and then ask, keep asking or a lot of questions. She's really scanning you. She wants to know what are the things that makes you happy, yeah, makes you angry. That's right. And the things that uh, she needs to adjust. True. Because... Dating a different nationality, you really need to know what are the things that they don't like. Correct. So that you could adjust right away. And same, same thing. Like, if you want to know more about her, you would really ask a lot of questions in order for you to adjust too. Yeah, so like vice, vice versa. versa. Yeah. For me, this is really important. So she makes time for you. No matter how busy she is, no matter how hectic her schedule is, she would really put time for you and effort. Correct. So no alibis. Yes, no alibis, no reason out. Because once you're important to her, even though you're at the tip of the mountain or Mount Apple. <laughs> <laughs> she, she will really make time to communicate with you. Yes, true. Even if you're near to her and maybe you're in the like in same the house. same same Roof. island, same island, the same island, and you're the, in the tip of the the island, and she's in the other tip of the island, she would go there. Right. Effort. She she would she would really show her effort because you are a special person. You're important. Even if you are in the same roof, like okay, you're living together, then she will always make time for you. Yeah, time and effort. Because being a housewife, this is what I observe. If you are a housewife, and this is one trait of the Filipinas, maybe they're lacking, like 50% lacking. Because once you're a housewife, they're, you're already tired, exhausted from everything that you've done in a whole day, and you don't have time for your partner. Right. Don't and, be like really preoccupied for yourself. Give time. Yeah, give time. Because talking to your partner give also a good relationship and a good communication as well yeah and there are some filipinas also that they will always use their phone instead of giving time to their partner it's true it's really true yeah we should always put or manage our time yes you need to communicate again communication is really important in a relationship I believe that's it. Yeah, just remember those uh, green flags of Filipinas. And uh, you have to notice that at first, at the beginning in your relationship. Once again, you have to be upfront, to be honest and transparent. Yes. So thank you so much, guys, for watching till the end. And we hope to see you in our next vlog. No hate. Just love. Bye. Bye.